Hola Chicanos. Pride. Malios. Lust, number 11 in this deck. This is strength. Hmm. That's Leo energy, but on the right track. Heartbroken. Oh, sorry to hear that, Leo. This is just pre-shuffle, mind you. So that's up to 14. Work with your spirit team. Spirit, lead me to the soul cycle of Leo. The pride, please. More strength. Imprisonment. Hmm. So that's up to 19, the sun. Clarity. Shedding light on uh, some truths. Being able to see through the enemy's smoke screen. Growth. Rejuvenation. Hmm. Children. Ooh, highly intuitive. Yes. That's up to 10 at completion. We got an out of the situation for our luscious needles, the pride. So it's a little big. Six of Pentacles. Okay, somebody could be getting paid for something. It's out of the situation. Pretty big, desperate. Give me one more. Oh, give me one more for uh, the heart of the situation. What's somebody getting paid for? Giving and receiving, or you can be receiving. I need one end it on. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, somebody has a lot of money here. This is ten pentacles. This is um, somebody spying on somebody's money. They're giving and receiving. They, they're seeing that somebody's giving to them. So that's up to 11 justice. This is the Prince of Swords. This is like um, somebody, um, that's the, the honorable, diligent knight. Whoever this is with the money is honorable and diligent in there. They can be trusted with it, it's saying they're in high standing. So. Oh no, this is the Prince of Swords. It's somebody coming in, rushing in, doing something quick. Oh my goodness. Oh, wow. This one can also... I don't know, this sort of reminds me of the devil, too, because... Because the devil's heir... You know how people know the, the devil sometimes in the Bible is described as the prince of the power of the heir. So he is an heir sign, right? Some people think he's a Capricorn, but I think he's an heir sign. This adds up to 11 justice. Mm. That's up to 17, Faith, Hope, and Healing, Aquarius. You could be getting noticed because of your, well, because you got 10 pentacles. Wherever you are, Leo. You could be going through a period of Faith, Hope, and Healing. That's possibly what a lot of the situation is. You're on a healing journey. Tina Saki to Michael. Mixing up a mean batch of swish. Working with some uh, high vibing entities. Uh, two of swords is you're gonna make a decision with your spirit team. This adds up to the tower. That's why it's in the challenge position. So your spirit team's gonna really shake the fuck things up. You gotta make the ultimate decision though. That's your challenge. And this is gonna cause the tower, I think, either way, either way you slice it. Actually, what you're thinking about there is an ace of uh, pentacles. You're thinking you got an idea that can be good on pentacles. So lose this idea. Maybe even write it down. If you haven't got it, you're going to get it in a, in a dream. Or you can just maybe walk into the park. Sometime when you're, you're balanced and you're um, kind of teetering between uh, the 3D and the astral plane. You know what I mean? 
You'll get it when you're in that sweet spot. Subconscious. Fast, how the fuck did we get here, Neil? Ten of cups, my goodness. Okay, we well, came out of here with the most love. He had an adept. Whatever you came out of, it was mighty beautiful, okay? Hopefully you're carrying this all into the present. Let's see. It's a uh, Piscean energy. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. Oh, yo. You are the king of the forest! This is the emperor. You could be dealing with Marys, or I'm thinking that presently, if this isn't you, somebody's taking control of my big attack dog, big and body, all four kings in the deck. A very knowledgeable person, knowledgeable in everything. If they don't, they got somebody right beside them that can always uh, fill them in my, my elbows. Like the advisors to like the president or something, like Monica Lewinsky. Like very intelligent people that can really like service you in your time of need. What do we got in the future here? For Leo. that maybe aren't so uh, accepted in society or something like that. This can mean, but it can mean illusions too. Or options, many options. Wow. Okay, the way you've been influencing things there are luscious Leo's. Okay, beautiful. You're investigating things right now. You're being that hermit. You're going within. You are um, shedding light on the dark, uh, the dark inner caverns of your uh, inner universe, and you're uh, you're uncovering. Um, well, you know what you're uncovering. Only you know because you um, yeah, it's your universe, right? So you can uncover like past lifetimes. You can uncover many things. The deeper you go as investigating, or you can be investigating just something, maybe it's, uh, everything's not adding up, and you're pulling a Columbo, and you're like, just one day, shit like that. The bonnet deck is up for you, we got two of wands, taking control of your environment, grabbing the bull by the horns, we got some shackles in the back, just kidding, but no, I got them. What do we got in the heart of the situation, or hopes and fears, sorry. So it feels okay, your fear of the tower. It's basically just Dr. Death creating some change. This is, uh, don't fear the Reaper. Nine of Wands is you're extremely guarded. Mm, and you're fearing judgment. Or you could be hoping for divine judgment. This is the Aeon. This is divine judgment. I am Brimstone. This is very powerful shit. This is what you know something big's coming from. This is your God in for it. This isn't uh, your hope or fear. This is just what this nature in because of your hopes and fears. You're fearing like all out fucking like shit hitting the fan, like maybe a school bus and have enough food for 40 years because you don't want to deal with the horror that's coming. My goodness. Be careful that you don't manifest this into the into the actual universe because yeah, there's, there's some fucking pretty out there fears. And they might just be in your head too. They might not even be uh, legitimate fears, right? The lens you be looking through though is the star. Faith, hope, and healing. You are going through a period of healing. It's an odd of the situation. So I wish you well on your healing journey. In the environment. Okay, let's come on. Blocked. Princess of Cups could be blocking you in the environment. Block, blocking you with like love bombs or this is imagination. Be using illusions, casting illusions around you. What do you got in your outcome? Closing all cycle with the universe. Beautiful, beautiful energy. Level up. New level, new devil. Three of 
Okay, so group of like-minded individuals. Okay, so you're closing out a cycle with a group of like-minded individuals. They might not be like-minded individuals. Like, they may be like-minded, but not like your mind, because you're an anomaly. You're, you're, not, you're cut from a different cloth. They say, uh, most uh, awakened people, they break out of the masks that they've been uh, programmed into wearing since they, they got slapped on the ass and told, oh, you go to school, you know, you need to be programmed or whatever. They're breaking out of those um, molds and they're creating a beast that's, in, that's uh, totally unique to every person that has one. It's just some people, it's easier to follow the herd off the cliff, right? It's a lot easier. A lot of people, it takes some, something pretty traumatic to shake them out of that. You know, I mean, the tower has to fall easier right on their fucking head to wake them up out of their slumber. This is a seven of wands. This is somebody who's in high standing, protected. This is you, Leo. It's with them. Now you're gonna, this is how you're going to be when you when you close this cycle out. Leo, you know, Holy Spirit, what would you like to tell our leaders of the Zodiac, the Leos? Okay, the Empress. Be the Empress. This is all four kingdoms. Receptive to everyone, but always stay mainly in the Queen of Swords mode. Be vigilant as to catch everything. And if you have to lop a head off, you're the Queen of the Sky. You're like James Bond 007. You got a license for that shit. <laughs>